I really like this. They have a nice hinge on them. Here today with a Zopower solar panel, spelled Z-O-U-P-W, but it's pronounced Zopower. This is a 300 watt N-type 16 BB solar cell panel. It's pretty cool because it's got an ETE coating, so waterproof, dustproof, all that stuff. It's got an aluminum frame that's pretty rugged. It folds up nicely in this pack. These handles are super satisfying. They're the aluminum and they got nice little rubber on them, uh, like plastic dip kind of rubber. And for what they are, they're pretty lightweight and they come with MC4 connectors, so they're easy to plug and play. Now, they do come with a three-year warranty at the time of shooting this video. I'm gonna go ahead and get them set out. It is a little cloudy today. There's a pretty big cloud right now, but I am gonna set this up off camera, get it going into my Blue Eddy here, and we'll see what it's putting out, probably with the cloud still out, and then we'll kind of check it once the sun's back out. Real fast, it does come with some cables. You've got a lot of options here. It's got the solar to all of this stuff. You've got, um, we'll probably actually just use this to go into the Blue Eddy just to save a step, but it's got like power pole and some, you know, barrel plugs and a little adapter. And so you get a nice bit of cable and it's pretty long too, which is nice. Sometimes these solar panel companies just give you a little bit hanging off the panel, which I really hate. So pretty happy about this. Let me show you this real quick. I really like this. They have a nice hinge on them, so they open. Obviously, don't let them slam. It makes it super easy to unfold these. And then they do have a uh, wire stand back here. I don't know if you can see that. Pretty nifty, very nice. So yeah, if I step back here and put it in the sand a little, we're not gonna get the best angle again, but we should get something decent. We're only doing about 64 watts in right now, but again, the sun's behind a cloud and we're not at the optimal angle but we should have some sun here shortly. Um, it was really sunny earlier and I just was waiting for the sun to get in a slightly better angle. I may try to move these panels a little this way and see if I can get better. So you can see here, I mean, they take up a little bit of space, but you're getting 300 watts in a foldable panel, which to me is pretty dang impressive. And again, I really like these handles. A lot of the times these things have terrible handles and those are part of the aluminum frame, or at least they're fastened to it, but they're like very sturdy and that rubber coating's nice. Sometimes they'll have plastic ones and you'll have like mold lines and they'll kind of dig into your hand or they'll have a fabric strap and you're like, mm, I don't know about this, but I'm really happy with these. And I've moved the battery around so we can not be in the way. 82. So I'll come back in about 15 minutes and this cloud's gone. All right, so the cloud is gone now. And I don't know if you can see that very well, but we're doing 216 watts right now. And again, this isn't the optimal angle and stuff for the panels, but there's the 216 right there. I'm pretty happy with that. It's 1.3 hours to get to full. I'm gonna see if I can't readjust these a little and see if we can get a better uh, reading. Unfortunately, it looks like the best I'm going to get out of these is 216 right now. It's just, I, I'm not at a good angle here. If I went farther away from the house, but I really don't want to go stand out there and get sand all over the battery and my shoes. And so, yeah, I'm still extremely happy with the 216. Really, I need to have the panels more like this and wait probably another hour. But you get the idea. This is still outputting more than any panels I have. You know, now we're losing the sun to a cloud for a second, but... Extremely happy. Um, these are made really nice. They have a nice, like, protective coating here. It's got, like, a, almost a rubbery kind of feel, just textured. And, you know, I imagine the rain's going to wash off of it pretty easy. Actually, let me uh, see. I don't know if that hose will reach over here, but we will try. I don't want to get the battery wet. Let me get you in the tripod, and let's see how moisture kind of goes off, and then check the readings. Now, I do have to be careful here, again, because of the battery. I don't want to ruin that really nice battery, but I've got the hose going, and... Oh, getting awfully close to the battery there. But that water beat it off just as fast as I thought it would. And yeah, we're still like rock steady, 219, 220. I am so happy with these things. I have wanted something that'll do more than 100, 150 watts for quite a while. And I saw these and just, I had to have them. Really happy with this. I'll have a link to these in the description and sticky comment like normal. These are the Zo Power, Z-O-U-P-W, Zo Power. I'll see you guys in the next video.